Hi, I'm Lucas with Bound Insurance, and I want to talk to you about renter's insurance. It's almost like a, a home policy, but without the dwelling coverage. And when I say dwelling, I mean, you know, the walls and roof, because you're a renter. You're worried about your items, your liability, personal property uh, coverage. That's what's going to cover your furniture, your clothing. Now, the other important part the, uh, to the policy is going to be your liability. This covers what damage you do to others or if someone's trying to sue you. This is also why a lot of apartment complexes are wanting you to have insurance or your landlord might ask you to have renter's insurance. Another way liability might cover you, and this kind of ties together with uh, medical payments to others or non-residents, is say you have a guest over that trips and falls, injures himself, you know, the medical payments to others will pay up to a thousand or higher if you have you know, higher limits. Uh, just like a homeowner's policy, renters is going to cover personal property, jewelry, furs, firearms, things like that. You'll want to list individually. These are called scheduled items, uh, and it's always a good idea to have those laid out. That way you don't have a deductible applied to it. You can take an inventory of all your personal property. This will help the, the claims process go faster. Uh, anything from you know writing a list out, or everyone has smartphones now, just take a quick video of the house, and this will help out uh, a lot in the claims process. If you have questions about renter's insurance or uh, you'd like a quote, contact me, uh, Lucas, at Bound Insurance.